This Chef's Kitchen podcast is brought to you by Audible.com. Get a free audiobook download now at audiblepodcast.com slash the chef's kitchen. by Chef Robert Weedmeyer. I got live scallops from Maine today. Beautiful. Where should we begin, sir? Let's start right here. Okay, so here okay. they are, the live scallops. So these are these are live scallops. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to take my knife and we're going to just take that membrane off okay. very carefully here. So here you have the whole inside of the scallop now. So what we want to eat is this part, obviously, which okay. everybody knows is, is the is the, the muscle. So we just cut that, you know, right underneath here. So you just take that and the whole thing comes out. So then what we're going to do is take this membrane off here. Okay. See, that's that's tightening up right now, see that? We're gonna take this part right out here, which we, we don't wanna eat. Okay. This is where it filters most of the, its food. And so, and then you have your scallop like this. So what yes. I'm gonna do is take this muscle here, and I'm just gonna cut this, the membrane here. So we're just gonna take a little bit of butter. Into a nice in. hot pan. Or not no, too, not it's too hot. Not you, hot. Want it, you want it just to sweat okay. a little bit. So then we're gonna take a little bit of shallots. They're chopped, finally. Right. Okay. Are we going to strain this out, or are we actually going to We're going to strain this, and then we're going to add this. We're just going to let this cook for a little bit. We don't want to get any color on it, because we're going to make a white sauce out of this. Okay. Okay. What I want to do then is I want to add a little pinch of thyme. All right, so here we go. We got This is moving along like this. Okay. So we're just going to add a little bit of this into here. Okay. Okay. And then we're just let that reduce a little bit. So now, you know, all the flavors are gonna come together. We got the acid from the wine, we got the, the essence from the, the membrane of the scallop. Yes, gonna, then our nice fresh herb. A nice fresh herb. We're just gonna let that sweat for one second. And mm. then we are going to monte a little bit of butter into this after I add just a touch of cream though, when it just goes a little bit longer. Is that heavy cream? Heavy cream, but just a little bit. Okay. Okay, let that whisk in here. Now, Tina, if you can grab me that butter over there. Of oh, no, it's right here. It's right here, hon. It's right here. Oh, you, oh it's right here. We already right moved here. it. You, we you, already you, moved it. We already used it. Okay, if you can just spoon me in some butter. Sure. Let's go. We'll just do a little bit at a time. So what we want to do is leave this like, not too high heat when you're monta or when you're you know emulsifying a butter sauce, but you want it hot. If it's too cold, or if it doesn't have the it'll break on you. Now okay. we're going to get to the fun part, okay? okay. Now we're, we're going to actually cook these scallops, okay? Wonderful. So what, we're going to turn the heat up. We want to... We want to get a nice golden brown on those. Okay. The good thing about live scallops or you know dry packed scallops is that you can do that. Okay, and then we're gonna a little salt. And you were telling me that the the roe actually only come you only see it in these two distinct colors. Right, you're not gonna see it any other really color than these two colors, white and this right nice red. All right, so the sauce is done. Good. This is getting nice and hot. We're gonna throw a little bit of thyme into this. More that okay. beautiful fresh thyme. I'm gonna crush a couple garlic cloves. Mm -hmm. We're just take these and just smash these. Voila. Love how you used your hands. Okay. Let this go like that. Infuse that a little bit. Okay, now it's getting nice and hot. Okay. Now we're going to take this and put this right in here. Nice. So I'm okay. And it's interesting, you're keeping the roe right on it. Right on it. Okay, now what we're going to do is we're going to take a little bit more butter here. Okay. And we're going to do a little bit of fricassee of vegetables. We're going to have peas and giro mushrooms. Okay, now I'm going to take this off. Okay, so now. Because now I'm going to do it on a higher heat. With For the this. scallop. Yeah. So at this point, is the roe is the It's pretty cooked? much cooked. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So I'm going to just take this off. Yeah. You don't want to overcook it. Okay. So we take that off. Okay. And then we're going to like really get some heat on this now. Because we want okay. a not nice, right. crusty. Right. I'm syrup. actually going to take these now and just put these in here. Okay. Because I want to get the essence of that just to poach them a little bit. We're going to add some peas. Fresh peas. Fresh peas, love them. Okay. Eat them like candy. All right, they're good for you too. Mm. We like those. Great for you. Okay, we're gonna let those saute. Mm -hmm. A little bit of salt. Okay, now these scallops are done. Feel that with your finger. See how firm that is? Yes. Okay. We're gonna set that in here. It's all the presentation. Beautiful okay. presentation, by the way. Just like this. Okay, then we're gonna take our chanterelles and oh, peas. Oh, it smells beautiful. The mushrooms. Mm, when you brought it over, really. And then we're going to add our roe right here. This looks beautiful, chef. Really, really So we got the little mush mushrooms on there. These are chai flowers. You ever seen chai beautiful flowers? Beautiful chai. I love chai flowers to really beautify okay. a dish. Voila. Wonderful. Mm. Is it good? Mm. Tell the truth. 
Okay, good. I feel I'm good all now. choked up. I'm so excited. Oh, good. <laughs> <laughs> no, that is beautiful. That's good. got a wonderful texture to right. it. Exquisite. But I'd also like to taste a little bit of that roe. Yes, because that's really a treat. The roe. That's something that you really can't get it anywhere. Actually, it's the first time I've mm. seen it presented this way. Is that not? A, that's a beautiful scallop. Mm -hmm. Roe, Very tasty. and I'm gonna get one of those chanterelles too. Look at this roe. There you go. Beautiful color on that. Different, huh? Mmm. Yes. The texture is everything. Right, right. Very beautiful. Yeah, I like that executed a lot. dish. Something very unique. Something so, so you, Robert McMire. You oh, are truly you. unique. This Chef's Kitchen podcast was brought to you by Audible.com. Get a free audiobook download now at audiblepodcast.com slash the chef's kitchen. Log on now for over 75,000 titles to choose from for your iPod, iPhone, or MP3 player.